That's the best place in the world. I mean, that's where I got my start. And I, you just meet people who love doing comedy and make enough friends, and hopefully some of them get job famous, and then they get you jobs, and everyone helps each other. Are <laughs> the spot? Hi. Hi. So you're going to be on my YouTube. Is that okay? I think that's fine. All right. And we are rolling. Got us both? Yep. So what do you like better, sitting in a booth and recording your voice or standing on stage? Wow. Uh, I like going on stage. I've always liked performing. It's always a lot of fun. But you can go and record voiceover in your pajamas and no one cares. So I can be lazy in that, but uh, I do. I love performing. I did a Bright Citizens Brigade for many years, and I love that. And SNL was live, so I, I enjoy live performing. But a voiceover is the best. I, I like. I would like to do voiceover just because I could go in there and retake if I messed up. If, but on stage, if you mess up, people will. will yeah, that's. Like going, I like the idea of you could say anything and, and, and that's what happens. But on voiceover stuff, you or you you do a bunch of stuff and then other people go like, this is the best one, and they decide. So it takes it out of your hands, which makes it easier. What's the best thing about Bobby Moynihan? Oh. It's when Bobby fall like has to make a sound when he falls down. So we always have Panda, you know, because he's clumsy. So we have all these, uh, every episode, he has to fall down three or four times and go, ooh, ah, ooh, ah. And he, Bobby's so good, he has a million ways to fall down. So that is by far my favorite thing about Panda. <laughs> or Bobby Moynihan, yeah, yeah. I, I actually never realized that he fell down like every episode. Yeah, he always does. He's always on the ground. Yeah, he can't stay up on, yeah, he has no legs. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, um, I haven't got to see him yet today, but um, he is awesome. I love him so much. Yeah. Hi, Bobby. <laughs> Do you have any friends on the set of We Were Bears? Uh, yeah, uh, I, uh, Daniel Chung, the guy who created we Bear Bears. Uh, I know him from working on Inside Out. I was in Inside Out as well. And uh, Eric Edelstein, the guy who plays Grizz, and Dimitri Martin, who plays uh, Ice Bear, are friends of mine. And we, they're, they're wonderful. They're, everyone gets along very well. I love the cast of We Bear Bears. They're all wonderful people. Charlene Yee. I've never met Jason Lee. He plays Charlie. I've never met him before. Say that that name sounds familiar, and I thought Jason it was gonna. Lee, he was on My Name Is Earl. He was in a bunch of stuff. You said you were Inside Out, right yeah. now. What what were you in Inside Out? Do you know the scene in Inside Out where the two little blue construction workers are, are sucking up the memories and they make her sing the the gum theme song? Yeah. That's me. Uh, ah. Yeah, I'm okay. one of those guys. All right. Uh, if you could go to any fictional place, where would you go, and why would you go there? I would go. I mean, any place in the Star Wars universe. I don't know why the first thing that came to mind was Toontown from Roger Rabbit. I think that would be really fun. That that does sound fun. I never right? I never thought of that. That would be a good one. I'll go Toontown. We'll go together. Yeah, we totally go together. Take Benny the Cab. I would probably want to go to Hogwarts. Smart. That's a great one. That's a really good one. Thank you. That's such a pleasure. I'm, you're you're gonna you're gonna be my boss someday. I feel like. <laughs> yeah, can I go run and get my car to show you? Sure. <laughs> I have to go now. Time is running out. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, smash it real hard, hit the like button, and share it with all your friends. See ya.